What's up everyone? Today I have a live cop of the Jordan 13 Obsidians that dropped today. Um, when I was going for this drop, I was only going for one pair for a friend of mine, so that's why all my sizes were size 10. But you can see here, when I started a couple tasks early to see if the QA thing would pop up, and it did, as you can see. Surprisingly though, I didn't have to solve any captures, it just went straight to the queue. Um, if you ran in the past, you'll know that the QA's usually pop up a capture, but for this drop, all five of the cap of the QA browsers popped up, and you'll see it just it just made me go in line. It didn't make me solve any captures. Um, I don't know if this is a new thing with NSB or if the foot size only did that because the shoes were bricks, but I don't know. Uh, it did take a while for the browsers to load, like it just showed a red a white screen for a while, but eventually they all did load in. As you can see right there, all five browsers show the same thing. So that's what you like to see. That's what how you know. Um, you're in the queue it So now the drop has started now you can see on the top right. It's 701 one minute into the drop You can see all my all my tasks says waiting for queue it and you're gonna see in a bit something happens All of them switches to adding to cart at the same time Which I've never seen before and then one does check out but here it is you can see all of them switch and then So like I said, that's really weird. I never seen that before but it's a pretty good thing because all of them got their queue at, at the same time. You see all of them went from adding to cart to waiting for restock. Some of them was retrying payment because three of my tasks were trying to check out the shoe at the same time. But I have my billing profile setting set on check out one item per site. So that's why all three of them didn't go through. Only one of them did. So that, that ended up being the only pair I got. I didn't want to go for more than one pair. I just got that one pair for a pre-order of mine. Also, another thing you'll see you see there that it was I copped it with my Oculus ISPs, which I'm sponsored by. So, if you want a discount for that, stay tuned to the end of the video. I'll have a promo code for that so you could get 25% off your order. But that's pretty much gonna be today's video, guys. Like I said, um, this was just a quick live cop video of the Jordan 13 Obsidian that I dropped today. Got that one pair for a friend of mine, size 10, with my Oculus ISPs. Copped it on Champ Sports. But if you have any questions at all, feel free to leave it down in the comment section, and I'll try to get back to you as soon as I can. Also, I um, I was running my NSB on a Leaf server today, in case you guys cared about that. That's what server I used. But anyways, if you guys haven't yet, please subscribe to this channel, like the video, and here's my sponsorship videos. If you guys are still looking for a cook group, I highly suggest you guys get Drop Alert. Now that I'm sponsored by Drop Alert, you can use my promo code JC15 to get 15% off your order. As you can see here, it's $20 a month, so give it a try. Try out a month and see how it works for you. Starter Square is a Discord-based cook group that will teach you how to resell. Currently, our memberships cost less than $10 a month. After you purchase a Starter Square membership, you'll be provided with information to help you become a successful reseller. In our Discord server, we provide retail and resell information, low-key flips, PlayStation 5 information, raffle links, retail flips, one-on-one -on -one support, lot classes, and so much more. You won't regret joining. If you would like to purchase a membership, please visit the link in the description below. We hope to see you in our server.